Our top story, legislation to replace the $100 banknote with a new polymer bill was passed in the House of Representatives just after 10 p.m. on a Friday. Minister of Finance Colm Imbert said in the miscellaneous provisions proceed of crime and central bank bill 2019 from the date of notice by the central bank to the appointed date, citizens can use the old paper notes and the new notes. But after at the end of the period, only the polymer notes will be accepted. Mahalia Joseph Wharton has more. 31 votes from opposition and government MPs respectively passed the miscellaneous provisions proceed of crime and central bank bill 2019. Minister of Finance Colm Imbert said people who cannot exchange their $100 bills for the new polymer note for circumstances beyond their control will be given a grace period of three months. Whatever, whatever the appointed date is, which is the date of cancellation of the notes, from that day, the central bank has been given the discretion for a three-month period beyond the date of cancellation of the notes to redeem notes for persons who found themselves in difficulty and for one reason or another were unable to come into the bank to deposit or change out the notes. Point of Peer MP David Lee said the opposition was in full support of the new polymer bill, but said the opposition is concerned about the timing of the introduction of the new bill. When you look at this Christmas period, Madam Speaker, and we are hoping that it does not, um, it can cause panic and chaos in the system if it's not properly managed the introduction of this new $100 bill, which will co coexist with the old $100 bill. And if an, uh, enough lead time isn't given to remove the old $100 bill, um, it can cause chaos and panic in the, in, the, in the system, especially during this Christmas period. Minister of National Security Stuart Young reiterated that the new note will have additional security features to crack down on money laundering. This is an effective way to curb black money economy, corruption and counterfeiting. It will completely deal with the counterfeiting issues that we're dealing with right now. The changes in the legislation will also reduce the notice period of the central bank from three months to 14 days. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TTT News.